Hi everyone and thank you for watching my channel. This video is going to show you how to install Visual Studio Code on your Chromebook. Now these instructions are for Intel Chromebooks. I will show you a website which you can download a version of Visual Studio Code for your ARM Chromebook, but I can personally verify that method because I do not have an ARM Chromebook. But before we begin, I'm going to show you how to identify whether you have an ARM or Intel Chromebook. Now, in order to do this, you need to have Linux installed on your Chromebook. And to do that, um, check out my video on how to install Linux. All right, so once you have Linux installed, open up a terminal. And here's a terminal. And here it's open. Now, to see whether you have an Intel or an ARM Chromebook, type LS CPU. And you get some text. If next to the architecture section, you see x86 underscore 64, that means you have an Intel Chromebook. If it says anything else, then you have an ARM Chromebook. So in order to install Visual Studio Code on your ARM Chromebook, you're going to have to visit the website code.headmelted.com. I personally can't install the file there since I don't have an ARM Chromebook. So if you are able to get it working, please let me know in the comments. Okay, so for those who have an Intel Chromebook, let's begin the installation process. I'll exit out of this terminal and then I'll open up Chrome and then we'll go to the website code.visualstudio.com and from here you want to make sure that you download the .dev file that I'm highlighting right now. Click on it and then the download will begin. Once the download is done, click on show in folder and here we can see the download in our downloads folder. Now there are two ways to install Visual Studio Code from this file. The easy way is by right clicking on the file, then click install with Linux beta. You have a window come up, click install on that window. And here on the bottom right, you'll see the installation progress. And the download is complete. So we now have Visual Studio Code installed. But before I open up Visual Studio Code, let me show you the other method of installing the Visual Studio Code download. So you want to open up your files and then go to your downloads folder. And then the file that you downloaded from the website, you want to copy it into this Linux files area. So click on it, then click right click and then click paste and wait for it to finish copying. Okay, the files completed copying. Now we want to open up another terminal window. And then we copied it directly to the Linux files area. So the terminal window automatically defaults to that location. And then we'll be able to see the file by typing ls. And we see it right here. Now to install this file from right here, all you have to do is type sudo apt get install dot forward slash and the name of the file. I'm going to copy it and then paste it and then you hit enter. I already have it installed so nothing is being installed anyway. So this is just another method in case you want to, something goes wrong with the easy method, you can use this method to install Visual Studio Code. Okay, and we have it installed. So if we go to the app launcher, we'll have Visual Studio Code right there showing up. You can also go into the Linux apps folder and Visual Studio Code will be there also. And when I click on it, Visual Studio Code will start loading and it's loaded. And that's how I install Visual Studio Code. I created other videos on how to set up different programming languages like Python, C Sharp, C++, and Java. So check out those videos. Anyway, if you like this video, please give it a like. And if you want to see more content like this, subscribe to my channel. Thank you, and I'll speak to you next time.